Now, do you know what a chef is? A chef is someone who cooks food. And as a chef, we can do so many fun things. Like we can learn new recipes. Cheesecake bars. That sounds so good right now. We can help other chefs in the kitchen too. But my favorite thing is being creative in the kitchen. Today, we're making special jello. Now, do you like jello? I'm gonna pour some of this red. And then I'm gonna pour some of this blue. And then I stir it. And now I have purple jello. And maybe I'll add some berries too. Who? Who? It's Ollie! Hello, Jackson. Being a kid chef, are you? Hey, Ollie, I sure am. We get to learn new recipes, help cook dinner, and be creative in the kitchen. I know someone who created you to do all those things. It's true. Listen up, just follow me through. Follow me through, follow me through who? Ollie's got a Bible story for me and you. I'm Aisha, and welcome to my cupcake food truck. It's wonderful to see you today. Today, I created some cupcakes just for you. <laughs> Do you want to see? Ta-da! <laughs> I call them my decorate your own cupcakes. Have you ever decorated a cupcake? This is going to be so much fun. Let's put some sparkly sprinkles on the cupcakes together. Just move your hand like this. <laughs> Good job! They look so yummy! <laughs> hey! Making these cupcakes sparkle reminds me of our story today. If you're ready for a story, on the count of three, yell, tell me a story! One, two, three, tell me a story! Today's true story from the Bible begins with the one who made everything. That's right, God! <laughs> God made the whole world and everything in it. God made the bright stars, the moon, and guess what else God made? <laughs> God made you and God made me. God made all people. And people are the most special thing God made because God made us to be like Him. One way God made us like Him is we're creative. We're creative when we paint a picture, or dance, or sing a song, or cook something yummy to eat. <laughs> Can you pretend to paint in the air? <laughs> Great job! <laughs> Another way God made us like Him is we can think. Everybody kiss your brain. God made us to think. Like, how does the sun know when to shine? How does a flower grow? There are so many things we can think about. Hmm. <laughs> Another way God made us like him is we can help. When we see someone fall on their bicycle, we can go up and help them. When we see a friend cleaning up their toys, we can go and help them. When we see someone who is sad, we can help them by sharing a smile and being a good friend. Isn't that amazing? God made us to be like Him, to be creative, to think, and to help. God made us all wonderful. Did you like the story? If you did, give it two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. 
Oh, hey, Ollie. Tell me, who made you wonderful? God made me wonderful. Yes, it's true. Now, let's hear it from you. Tell me, who made you wonderful? God made me wonderful. That's the truth, friends. See you next time. Bye. So there's your story, and it's all true. God made you in his image to create, think, and help, too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Hoo! Hoo! Wow. Now I know why I'm such a good kid chef. It's because God made us in his image. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it! Good. Well, it's time to keep creating, thinking, and helping in the kitchen. See you next time. Bye!